Welcome back to Rose Rocket Platform. In this video, we're gonna show you the most important part of your business's workflow, and that's order creation. Luckily for you, there are three ways to create orders in Rose Rocket. You can create orders automatically with OrderBot, our AI document scanner. You can import orders via CSV, or you can create orders manually. In addition to that, I'll show you how to duplicate existing orders and how Rose Rocket generates documents for you. Let's get started. First, let's create orders automatically with OrderBot. Are you tired of manual order entry? Well, with OrderBot, you can upload or email things like rate cons and shipping documents directly into the system, and in seconds, it automatically creates your order directly in your software. Let me walk you through the process. So first thing we're gonna do, from our order screen, we're gonna go ahead and select this dropdown, and we're gonna go ahead and upload our shipping request. So we're just gonna drag and drop our PDF into here and hit upload. Now that our system has successfully scanned your PDF, as you can see, the order is here and ready to be dispatched. As we scroll through the data panel on the order, you can see all of the imperative details that have imported in just a few seconds. Next, let's upload orders via CSV. If you wanna import a list of orders to Rose Rocket using a CSV, let's navigate to the three dot menu. From here, we're gonna go ahead and click upload data via CSV. This is gonna give you an opportunity to drag and drop your CSV into this section. All you have to do after that is match the columns to your data sheet with a template and upload them into Rose Rocket. Next, let's create an order manually. If you prefer to enter orders manually, we can help with that too. It's really easy. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna click create order from our order board. Now, we're just gonna follow the workflow built out in our widget. So first thing, we're gonna go ahead and select our customer. Next, we're gonna add any reference numbers that pertain to this order and then hit save. We're gonna go ahead and add in our customer rate here or our customer quote. Next, we're gonna go ahead and add in our pickup and delivery locations. So in this scenario, I'm gonna say that I'm picking up from Costco in Nevada. We're gonna go ahead and pick up some dog treats. Uh, these are all on skids, so we're gonna say we have 26 skids at a total weight of 40,000 pounds and hit save. Now that we've added our pickup information, we're gonna go ahead and add our delivery information. So we're gonna say that this is delivering to PetSmart in Manhattan, New York. Now that we've added our delivery location, we're also gonna make sure that our commodities from our pickup location are associated to this delivery. Once completed, we'll hit save details. This order is now in the system and it's ready to be dispatched. Now that you've entered this order, we're gonna show you how easy it is to duplicate it right from your orders board. So first thing we're gonna do is navigate to the orders board. We're gonna go ahead and select the order that we want to duplicate. And then we're gonna hit our duplicate button. This is gonna make an exact copy of the order, leaving out things like pickup dates, delivery dates, and load tender numbers. As we know, these change from order to order. If you wanted to bulk duplicate orders, go ahead and select the orders you wanna duplicate, and let's hit that same duplicate button. Lastly, did you know that platform generates documents for you based on all the information you entered in the system? In order to navigate to those pre-generated documents, we're gonna go ahead and click into the order and we're gonna select our documents tab. From here, you'll find different things such as bill of ladings and rate cons. And that's it. In this video, we just covered three key workflows for order entry creating orders automatically using OrderBot, our AI document scanner, 
importing orders via CSV, and creating orders manually. On top of that, we also showed you how to duplicate orders and how documents are generated in Rose Rocket. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time.